<laughs> All right. Uh, welcome. We should be live. Chat, can you hear us? Hello? Hello. 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 This works. Awesome. Wow. We are live. Welcome to Up, Up, Down. No, not that. Wrong channel. Uh, welcome <laughs> to Beetle and Grimm's. Uh, I am your host and dungeon master, Jason. Uh, mm. You will know me as the social media goblin. I run the uh, Twitter and sometimes the Facebook and sometimes the Instagrams. Uh, we have a great cast here with us today. Um, lots of stuff going on. Uh, I got my uh, Fizzman Surgery of Dragons. I saw some other people got that too. Those are shipping now. Uh, we got dice uh, tins in the store online. I believe Paul has one of those ready to go. Boom. Awesome. Yes. Uh, but yeah, welcome to everyone in the chat. Welcome to our lovely players. Uh, I will be running... An encounter out of uh, Wild Beyond the Witchlight that we wrote. This was written by Justice Armand. It's a shame he uh, passed away and is dead to us now. Um, yeah. Uh, no, he got a job. He's working for Wizards of the Coast. He's now a senior game designer. So. I was like, that is so <laughs> dark. Holy shit. I was like, what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was There's thinking you're like, by the tone, and he's very like, much yeah. alive. <laughs> oh, I literally got so scared. Oh no, 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 no. That's our, uh, we, it's a love slash hate slash hate relationship uh since he he left us no we're we're happy for him but that's our joke uh but he wrote this one uh i will be modifying it so if you have our silver or platinum wild beyond the witch light uh i'll be running the leviathan of wildlife lagoon uh it's the first adventure in there uh yes we love to hate justice uh, and we hate to love him i mean wait let's cross that reverse it uh but uh, let's go ahead and introduce our players. Uh, according to Twitch, we'll start at the top left. Uh, Lua, do you want to go ahead and introduce yourselves? I'm always first. I knew this was going to happen. <laughs> uh, hi, my name is Lua Stardust. I am an alternative model, cosplayer, just all-around internet person who focuses very heavily on uh, TCGs, D&D, Magic the Gathering, stuff like that. Uh, if you want to find out more about me, you go to lewisstardust.com or you can go to campcryptopodcast.com, which is where I upload my weekly spooky theme podcast. That's it. Woo! <laughs> Woo! All right. Uh, Paul, you don't grab Overlord. Yes. Why don't you go next? Uh, uh, I'm Paul Shapiro. I'm one of the founders of Beetle and Grimm. Uh, I've been playing D&D &D with, uh, with that group of folks uh, for decades and decades. Um, I, uh, yeah, and... My day job is is Beetle and Grimm's, and my night job is Beetle and Grimm's too. So that's what I do. <laughs> one, of, one of our two full-time employees. Uh, yeah. That's right. Awesome. Uh, Patrick, head around to you. Yes. Hello, everybody. My name is Patrick Keith. I am an actor and voice actor, and uh, you can find me everywhere on the internet at That Gray Gentleman. Uh, you can also find me over at uh, Level Up Dice, where I do content creation for them as well. They are a boutique dice company. Um, and I think that's it. I'm going to be playing Sparrow Fairmate today, uh, who is a oh. satyr cleric of trickery. I don't know if that... I, <laughs> it's like I had everything in my head. <laughs> then, uh, I was like, oh, it's my turn. Uh, <laughs> Uh, Flaming Hell Badger, I turned up the volume a little bit. Apparently, when I hit streaming, it auto corrected to like the middle of the road, and I don't. Uh. Know. So, uh, it should be better now. Uh, thank you. Thank you for keeping us on our toes. Uh, and last but not least, Vivka, why don't you go on next? So, you said that you were going around. I saw Lua. I'm like, okay, I'm below. I'm next. And then he went to Paul, and I'm like, okay, went, so we're reading, clockwise. so now it'll be me. And then he went to Patrick, and I'm just like, I forgot. What's happening? <laughs> I'm looking at the, the, the stream uh, thing over here in OBS, and so I was going around that way. So Clockwise. Yes. Hello, everyone. Uh, I am Vivid Vivka. That's Vivka, not Vidka, not Vivica. It's a lot of things it's not, but it is Vivka. Um, I do some things online, mostly uh, dressing up as characters. You can find me mostly on my TikTok which was deleted, so if you were following me before, <sighs> please follow me again, because I lost everything. Uh, that's vivid point, Vivka, period. But yeah, I'm on uh, Twitter. I do stuff. Uh, super excited. Uh, I don't know if you can tell, but I'm going to play a tabaxi. Um, just trying it on, seeing how it fits. <laughs> but also, my fangs are super loose, so enjoy them now, because I might lose them later. <laughs> oh, 
Fantastic, fantastic. Uh, and once again, I am your Dungeon Master. Uh, this will be taking place uh, post the events of Wild Beyond the Witchlight, just to keep it kind of simple. Um, hopefully, no spoilers. We'll try to avoid those. Um, there's fairies. Ooh. Um, but yeah, okay. uh, do we want to do character? Well, we'll get, we'll get to character introductions. Uh, sure. Yeah, Vivka is in a swing uh, for everyone's <laughs> edification. So it's the best. It's, it's awesome. The best. Yes. I'm never, I'm never leaving this. this is that is, that's sweet. That's super that's cool. Good. Very good. I did, uh, I did a stream yesterday, and everyone like, like the stream started, and I started swinging a little, and everyone's like, "You look like you're in a pirate ship." <laughs> <laughs> Sing some shanties. Nari immediately wanting a swing now. <laughs> yeah. I gotta say, like this is this is a, my best move. Although I can do that too. I can do that too. <laughs> I'm getting seasick watching you, Paul. So, yeah, yes. I'm getting seasick doing this. <laughs> yeah. All right. So I will I will so. try to keep my swing into a minimum, but <laughs> your cat got crazy yeah. ADHD brain, so it's like the swinging <laughs> helps me not be like. Mm. <laughs> oh. Awesome, awesome. All right. Uh, well, let us head into the world of Prismere. You did um, say that you wanted us to uh, introduce our characters. Do you want uh, to do I was going to do that. Well, we can do that now. We can do that now. Uh, Vivka, we'll start with you. We'll go back clockwise the other way. Counterclockwise. <laughs> uh, Winterchins. Hello. Uh, when Vivka takes off her mortal coil, I am <laughs> Binks. Uh, I am my first ranger. I've never played a ranger. Uh, I am a level three tabaxi ranger. It's a type of ranger, but I don't think I really want to tell you yet. My ear got caught. I don't think I really want to tell you yet. <laughs> I'm going to surprise you later with it. That's it. Anticlimactic. I'm <laughs> no, no. That was... <laughs> All right. Uh, going back around. Patrick. Uh, yes, I am playing a Sparrow Fairmate. Pleasure to meet you all. Uh, I am a cleric of uh, the good Queen Zibl Zibilna? Zibilna? Zibilna. Yes. I am I'm very dedicated, as you might be able to tell. <laughs> uh, and I reside in the trickery domain. And if I'm telling you that up front, just uh, maybe wait to see what I might be hiding up my sleeve. Awesome. Her voice is fun, and I like it. Wow! <laughs> I had no idea that I had no idea that we were in the in the Scottish part of Prismere. I love that. <laughs> I love that. Uh, uh, Paul. Yeah, yeah. So I'm playing uh, Bugsy the fairy. So I'm uh, Bugsy. Uh, I grew up on the wrong side of the uh, tracks here in Prismere, but uh, but I got a good heart, uh, and I just want to do what's best for uh, my the lovely land of Prismere. I am a swashbuckling rogue, uh, which means that uh, you get in my way, things won't go well, but uh, you may not even see me come. And I have, uh, I have uh, wings, I fly, and if I move too quickly, um, I, uh, I sparkle. It just is a thing that I do as a fairy. So if I move too fast, I sparkle. So I got to be careful when I'm sneaking up, not to move too fast. <laughs> Uh, you know, I'm a fairy, you know, we do the sparkling thing. It's something we can't help. It. <laughs> yeah, you know, hey, so yeah, he's, he's going to do my lines too. It's okay. <laughs> I, I love mean, it. I, we all should try on Bugsy. Just, uh, I can't yeah. help it. It's, it's, uh, it's, it's kind of hard not to, right? You know, once you meet Bugsy, you're like, yeah, I kind of like Bugsy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, this game like, being dubbed by. <laughs> uh, and Lua. Oh, let's... Um, so I'm playing B. She's a little what Har Harrigan? Why Har am I so bad at names? I it's, say Harrigan. It's the bunny. Yeah, that sounds good. It's the bunny race. You know what it is. Yeah. Uh, so she's just a little uh, bunny bard, and um, like everybody else, she's got her business just out there for everybody. There's no secrets. It's just talking about everything because she doesn't shut up. Uh, she's a very humble little, you know, three ten and uh, three and ten quarters rather. And yeah, it's just a little middle child syndrome bunny out here on an adventure. That's all you gotta know. That's it. Fantastic. I, I didn't Love expect it. to connect so much to your character, but here we are. That's it. <laughs> Very good. I feel like we're all gonna get along. Um, <laughs> so I know we have. So how many small size characters? At least two. Um, small. I don't yeah. know. I didn't look. Uh, no, Tabax, you're generally medium. Um, I think I'm also medium. I believe you're. I, yeah, so I think we have two. I'm two. a satyr. 
I mean, we can. And I may be small. Roll. I may be small, but I have a big heart. Oh no. Just say Big hot what? Is it a hot pot? <laughs> you see, now things are just going to get ugly. Nah. Yeah, this, yeah. Is, this is, we're off Bugsy, track already. Like, it's like, good stuff. How small are you? Like, it's a really, really good question. I mean, um, are we like Tinkerbell range here? I just want to get a visual. It, by the rules, by the rules, I'm hobbit size, but I think I'm a little on the smaller side. I think I'm a really big action figure. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, ah, one forty-four bunny. scale. <laughs> I love that. That's oh, really tough. Don't mess with me. Very Don't mess good. with me. That's that's gonna be fun later. Okay. Awesome, awesome. <laughs> uh, yep. Yeah, so, uh, our adventure uh, guides us to the realm of Hither, uh, one of the splintered factions of Prismere, uh, and you are sent here by Queen Zabilna, who has been restored to power, uh, and her servant, uh, Sparrow, the satyr, uh, she bequeathed a, a quest to go to Hither, find out how the people are, what's going on, get a status update, um, you know, check in on her, her people. She can't be everywhere at once. She's still recovering. Bad, bad, you know how it goes. So, mm. um... She told you to meet up with her uh, knight errant uh, in the realm of Hither. Uh, and after some asking around, you found out he is most likely uh, at the inn of the end of the, at the end of the road, uh, which is a moving in uh, large building uh, on many many feet as it scurries through the realm uh, along the roads and swamps. And the swamp isn't so swampy anymore. Now it's just kind of mushy uh, as the evil is kind of getting cleared away. Uh, but mm -hmm. you guys come across this large inn that's moving uh, at a good pace uh, and just lots of little people looking legs kind of thing kind of shuffling along and the thing's just uh, moving along and you guys see it going. What are you guys doing? Well, I guess we got to get in there, right? So yeah. um, uh, who's going to, somebody's got to, uh, I don't know. Can you want to flag it down or I don't know. I was just going to say, I imagine that sparrow is just like trotting alongside. He's like, "Excuse me, hello, pull over. I have a business here. <laughs> is anyone? This isn't working. Anybody have any other ideas?" <laughs> uh, Binks is like just two steps behind you, just walking along. Just <laughs> what? Binks. What? You. Can you, like, jump up on top and tell them to, like, maybe, like, stop for a hot second? Yeah, I, I totally could do that, probably. But How she about won't. right oh, now? Do I agree? <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. Ooh, what is this accent that we're suddenly putting on? Sorry. I didn't plan this. <laughs> Look, it's a little bit Southern Belle, and I'm not mad about it. It's all good. Oh, I felt like I was going a little Jersey. All right. Oh, yeah, there you go. Um, yeah, I, I could probably, I could probably make that. And she like, you know, as she's walking, kind of like, like leans down a little bit. You see like a little, like, little <laughs> tail butt. Like, <laughs> and All right, and uh, leap. give me, um, athletics or acrobatics, either one. Yeah, see exactly like the the <laughs> I'm rolling on D and D Beyond, and I said every time I do a stream, it's like maybe. Oh. Uh, perfect, off to a great start. That's a six. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah. No, yeah, that's I'm mm. right, right. right on par with how I usually do. Let's yeah. So rolling, rolling um, for story. So so in her haste, uh, Binks gets so excited, uh, she jumps up, but door's not open and you kind of just hit the door and kind of <laughs> plop down on your butt um, as the it just kind of keeps going without uh, concern. Uh, what are uh, B and Bugsy doing as, as the two smaller peeps as the party is kind of moving forward? Uh, well, well, so, I mean, now that I see the cats just bounce off this thing, mm. uh, I realize we got to take this a little bit more Hawks. seriously. It has an anti-cat protection spell. Yeah. yeah. So I'm, I, I'm flying. So I'm fly At this yes. point, I'm flying along, right? Mm. So I, I put on a little speed, right? When I put on a little speed, 
Uh, you guys see the little rainbow sparkles kind of come out behind me. <laughs> Very good. But uh, I'm going to fly right up. Uh, is there a door? I'm going to fly up to the door. Uh, there are several doors, several windows. A couple of the windows Ooh. are open. Oh, there's a, there's a window that's open. Mm, yes. Yes. Oh, I'm going to. Can I? Is it? Can I fly fast enough to go right into one of the windows? Yeah, sure. Why not? Yeah. I'm going to fly right into the window. Okay. And I'm going to look around to see if there's a if there's an off switch or like a one of those the thing on the bus like you can pull to like request to stop. <laughs> can I request to stop? Um yeah, you <laughs> you uh fly in, you kind of look around and uh you see the 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 innkeeper, the barkeep. Uh she's at the kind of an older woman or in her 50s, kind of twigs and bristle in her hair. Um and uh she looks and says, "Oi, most people use the door." From outside, you hear, yeah, that was kind of the idea, but, um... <laughs> oh, yeah, so, yeah. it's hard. There are all these feet. Can we, uh, can we let them in? Uh, yeah, fine, and she, she reaches under, and you hear, like, a click, and a and the feet just slowly slow down and come to a stop, and and you hear the kind of like a bus. <laughs> And, and the uh, and the door in front of you, Vivka, opens up. Uh, no, fifty is an old. Fifty is older. So, uh, but anyways, fifty is not old. No, fifty no. is not, not in the Feywild. No, no. Uh, I like to imagine so, that as Sparrow's running and is like, "All right, think happy thoughts," and is about to jump, and then everything just kind of like screeches to a halt, and he just like flies past it, fifty feet, <laughs> and just face plants into the mud. Uh. Binks goes over to where the door is and she puts like her her hands kind of on her knees to or on her knee to make like a step for uh for B, because B's a little bit shorter. Mm. And she's I'm just like, wow, I really thought that I could make that jump, but apparently I was wrong. <laughs> yeah, I was just like, not again. This seems to always happen to us whenever we try to go anywhere, and then I'm just gonna hop up and get all the way to the top. Thank As you, you go up, I go, like bunny hop! <laughs> and I toss you up. Thank you. Uh, and like, then I, I grab the uh, edge of the the door and I just kind of like whoop, flip myself up. Sounds good. Sounds good. Bugsy, um, figure it out. <laughs> welcome. Hey, we made it. We made. Where's Sparrow? Oh wait, no, Bugsy's it. No, Sparrow. Figure I'm, it. No, I'm, I'm Bugsy. Yeah, so I'm Bugsy. Who's Sparrow? Did, 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 did somebody get Sparrow? Sparrow. Does he know? Does just... he know the door's open? Sparrow walks and turns in the doorway, is just covered in mud. Like, don't worry about me, I'm fine. Ah. Everything's good. We can't take you these a shower. Shots <laughs> uh, uh, the barkeeps, uh, n- no, we don't have a shower, but I can get you an ale if you wish. That'll uh, work. Things Something goes over to Sparrow, and she's like, I know, so embarrassing. Don't worry, I got you. <laughs> no, the, you're right. This is better. This is uh, so much better. This is just like progressively. Yeah. So, Jason, I'm gonna look around. I'm gonna look around in this inn, and I'm gonna see who else is in here. What kind of what kind of establishment is this? Um, it looks like most inns uh, that you've been to uh, in your travels. Uh, there are a number of tables kind of spread out. Uh, there's some alcoves on the opposite side of where you came in. Uh, the place is mostly empty. Um, in one of the alcoves, it looks like uh, it looks like there's an old man uh, in in black robes, uh, kind of holding a staff. Um, it looks like maybe his younger brother or something, very muscular man. And it looks like they have a small, uh, maybe elven child, pointy ears, looks very childlike, off in the corner, uh, and, and the 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 elderly. Gentlemen, you can't really make out his face. His, his uh, uh, robe is kind of hanging over his head. Um, but, uh, yeah, you see them, and they're kind of whispering amongst themselves. You can't quite overhear what they're saying. Uh, but as you look down, then you see uh, another table, kind of smaller child, like the children's table, if it were. Uh, and you see um, a small fairy dragon. Uh, seated at a table uh, with what look like uh, three dolls, and it looks like they're playing cards with uh, saltwater taffy as, as the ante and whatnot. And Sir Talavar, uh, 
who you recognize uh, is is playing cards with the dolls. And there's a one of the dolls is um, looks like a, a young boy with uh, orange hair and freckles, wearing sort of like an overall kind of thing going on. Uh, the other one has bright red hair in large big braids, and the other one uh, is an all black with a porcelain face and really no pupils in her eyes. And they're just kind of sitting there uh, as Sir Talavar is very animatedly like, Oh, I have a full house, so oh, I will always win again. Yes, Sir Talavar. I'm just going to point out, I'm just going to point out that to me, that is a perfectly regular sized dragon. <laughs> <laughs> Not small at all. Perfectly regular sized. I'm just like fairy dragon cards, saltwater taffy. It's like you made everything that I love in in one little D and D space. <laughs> yeah, very good. So, so are the dolls playing or are the dolls just sitting there? Uh, from this angle, it looks like they're just sitting there. Hmm. Okay. Oh. I'm gonna turn to Sparrow. The Sparrow was the one who uh, was given the instructions. I'm gonna say, so uh, is that who we're looking for? That would be the gentleman. Yeah, huh. that's about right. And that is also about right. Hmm. Let's introduce ourselves, I suppose. It's like slopping over in like my mud covered everything. Puts out a mud covered hand is like, greetings, Sir Talabar. I don't mean to interrupt your, your raggedy friends. Uh, uh, Sparrow, fair mates, servants of Queen Zablina. Ah, yes, I am also in the service of Queen Zablina. Welcome, and he takes your, you know, shakes your hand, and your finger, Just whatever. Like with one finger. Yeah, pretty like, much, yeah. Yeah, no, yeah. that's probably fair. That was the cleanest of the fingers. Yeah. <laughs> and he says, oh, well, thank you. I, uh, business calls, and he turns back to the table. Pardon me, people. We will continue this game at another time. And the dolls, yeah, this always happens, and they get up, uh, and the dolls kind of walk away, and they head up the stairs uh, to one of their rooms. Um, the the orange-haired one with the freckles uh, gets a drink uh, on the way up, and they will retire to the upstairs. Hmm. How does that work? They don't have innards, right? I'm not going to think about it too much. Don't, don't, anyway, I wouldn't, I wouldn't. Yeah, no, it, mm. They do have taffy, though, so I think that's how that works. Yes, oh. please, taffy have some absorbs, taffy. It is way more than I can eat on my empty tummy. Too much and you'll Absolutely. get sick, but please have Absolutely. some. Absolutely, we'll take a taffy. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, in any case, we were uh, sent to discuss a matter with you we're told that you might be able to assist us on our mission yes yes quite indeed uh i know someone who is in need of our services i passed them on the way here i would have helped them but i had an appointment and i gave my word i would be here but we can head to there now it is to the north to lilac lagoon <laughs> There's definitely an image that passes through Sparrow's mind where it's like somebody's got a broken leg on the side of the road and Sir Talavar is <laughs> like, no, nope, I must play cards with my doll friends and have tap. <laughs> like, yeah, like leaning uh, out of like the, the inn as it passes and being like, I'm sorry, you know how it is. Once you, <laughs> once you don't have the appointment, they're, they're three months out. I'm going to have to reschedule. It's just going to be a thing. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> These dolls work on the American healthy hair system of scheduling. <laughs> I, I would help you, but you're not in the right neighborhood. You're not in the network. <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, so, 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 Talava, so you're saying we need to go up to, uh, where did you say we need to go to a lake? Lilac Lagoon, to be specific. It is to uh -huh. the north. Once quite uh -huh. a very beautiful place, but sadly not so much anymore. Any uh, any uh, information about what it is you want us to do? Anything you uh, somebody we got to take care of? Somebody we got to you know straighten out? Well, my Easy friend up there. <laughs> Just saying. Just saying. <laughs> Comments. We talked about this. <laughs> so, uh, so 
Uh, first we will assist my friend Butterboots to make sure they are okay. They are the ones who seemed to be upset when I went past, but I could not stop to say hello. Butterboots. Got it. That's not literal, is it? Butterboots. Right. Uh, yeah, What'd you ask, Patrick? Conflict. Sorry? I said, that's not literal, is it? <laughs> I, I don't believe so. I believe it's a family name. An old family name going back many generations. Traditions are weird. I feel like Banks and B are just discussing, like, the texture. Like, just, do you think it's so squishy? Yeah. Like, not exactly. What happens when it hardens and your feet get stuck? It just seems like a lot. <laughs> what would happen on a hot day? Delicious, oh. but also not. But if you walk on toast, if you walk on toast, it would be perfect. You know what the you know the old saying: "Walk a mile in another person's toast, and oh. they'll punch you in the face." Walk <laughs> um, a mile in another person's butter boots. <laughs> uh, so, are any of you partaking in the taffy, or taking some with you, or what are you doing? Well, I, I mean, is. since we're in a bar, I'm gonna get a drink before we go. I'm gonna say, like, hey, since we're here, I'm gonna walk up to the bartender, the the lovely lady. Mm. And I'm going to say, uh, you know, uh, while we're here, I, I'd love a drink. Uh, and, uh, just uh, give me uh, something stiff. Uh, Binks walks up uh, to the bar next to Bugsy. I would like something very fluid, I think. Stiff and fluid. Mm. Yes. So got it all covered. It. Mm, yes. <laughs> we got it all covered. Can I get something springy? <laughs> And for the bunny just like folk. a little bit of a give. <laughs> oh, I'm good. I'm just going to have some of the taffy. And I'm just like shoving all the taffy in my mouth. Uh, B, as you're eating the taffy, uh, you do feel very good eating it. Uh, gain a temporary hit point. Oh! Ah. <laughs> there we go. Um, but yeah, uh, the barkeep kind of stares at you all and turns around and starts making some drinks. Um, and... Uh, Bugsy, the drink she puts in front of you is frozen solid. Um, and Binks, your drink is uh, very vaporous. Uh, and Sparrow, your drink kind of bounces and then walks away off the bar tent. Uh, Binks picks up her drink. Ah, oh, the vapors, the vapors. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Bugsy picks up his drink, shakes it a little bit, snaps his fingers, and a little rainbow sparkle, and then a little flame lights up, melts a little bit, and he shoots it back. <clears throat> I thought you wanted it stiff. You just melted it. Well, yeah, but it starts, you gotta, it start. it's just about how it starts, and then it goes. It, it worked. It was, it's the presentation. It was perfect. It oh, was perfect, well, I tell I'm you. Glad. I'm glad. So, I'm sorry, Thank Mr. You. Santa Folk, the bouncy drink bounced away. Mm. But... As it happens sometimes. Yes. Uh, Binks belches and a purple vapor comes out of her mouth and transforms into the word delicious in cursive and then flutters away and she tosses you a coin. Oh, she catches it. Oh, well, that was quite remarkable. What are you doing on Tuesdays? I could use some entertainment in here. <laughs> you want me to drink? <laughs> if you can keep doing the shows and making the, the funny looking uh, shapes and stuff with your drinks, sure. I think it does not sound like a, a professional thing. belcher. Looking shapes. Well, I have never once or twice, but not this week. And she just turns and walks away. <laughs> oh, well, can't well, win them all. You'll have to excuse my friend. She's, you know, a little, uh, I don't know. <laughs> She like comes over the shoulder, like there will be no excuse, and walks away again. Just As like, B hears this, she like Cassie. slides this like little makeshift business card that says her name, but it's written very poorly, and uh, it says like all services available of musical performance. Just ask, <laughs> just slide it, and walk away with more taffy. Very good. She'll take the you card and like, nod and put it somewhere for for later. So noted. Noted. So. Okay. Well, now that we're refreshed, uh, Sparrow, what do you think? Should we uh, should we head up to uh, the Purple Lake? 
Well, it seems like Butterbutu is in a bit of a bit of trouble, so we might as well. Yeah, I think you're right. Yeah. Was it what was it called? The do. Violet Inlet? Uh yeah, I think it was uh something like that. It was the yeah. uh It was called the Lily Valley, I think. Mm. Great, great. Yeah. No, I think it was the pink puddle. I think it was just the pink no, puddle. No, 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 no. You're all wrong. It is the Lilac Lagoon. Lilac Lagoon. Lilac L -L. Lagoon. Oh. Great. Right, of course, of course, yeah. of course. Named okay. after the various no, lilac dead. bushes that surround, well, used to surround the mm. the areas of the lake. Quite beautiful and such a wonderful smell, but not so much anymore. Puts a little, like, insert right before it says Lilac Lagoon. It says, not so. <laughs> the Good well, I, that's, that's a shame. That's a real shame. I think we should do whatever we can to bring the lilacs back. Right, like maybe like a parks program or something along those lines. Whatever it takes. I know this no, guy. No, maybe wrong. we He's maybe we go, we find out whatever's there, we lean on it a little bit, we say, look, get out of the way, make room for the lilacs. You and know what I'm saying? In addition to the parks program, perhaps one with recreational stuff. We right. can have yeah. a parks and rec observatory. <laughs> I'll we get my buddy wrong right on that. Big ideas. Big ideas. I mean, yeah. Uh, However, the place is, it's got to be better than uh, the saffron spittoon. Not at all nice or smelling good. That that was not oh. a great Tuesday. Mm. That is unfortunate. Yeah. yeah. That so sounds. Avoid saffron spittoon. <laughs> well, just avoid <laughs> spittoons in general, I think. Right. All colors. I like to imagine that it is like uh, a bar made specifically for fairy folk, and it is an actual like old cleaned out spittoon. Oh, oh. <laughs> you know we I, I actually kind of like this Sorry, spittoon. Man. It's a good place. We hang out there a lot. That surprises me not at all. But... Me and my gang, me and my gang used to hang out there. We right. sang songs. I say when we'll you're a fairy, on. you're a fairy. No. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we should uh, we should find this lagoon. We know who's we. We got to find the buttercups first. We got to find buttercups. Right, but but the butter boots. Mm -hmm. God, I hope no, it's buttercups. Have recipes it was buttercups. Shh. I'm sure it was okay. buttercups. You absolutely, Bugsy. Whatever you say. <laughs> it just like rubs his kneecaps. <laughs> uh, Binks is like the, uh, there is a window open, and Binks mm. is sitting on the windowsill like ready to jump out but like looking back being like are we going b are we good yeah i think we should go this sounds like a really good opportunity to leave this place <laughs> <laughs> there's so many dolls it's kind of freaking me out it just like <laughs> looks around it's all lined with doll like yeah <laughs> I didn't look before, but now I'm terrified. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, Bugsy's. I'm, I'm with you on Absolutely. that. Absolutely. I'm with you. Let's. Yeah. Uh, I think we should head out. Uh, we are heading out. Uh, can somebody check to see? Uh, is it is the inn still stopped? Can we just get out, or is it uh, is it a problem still? Uh, you haven't been here very long. Um, <laughs> uh, the inn the inn is currently still stopped. Okay. Beautiful. Okay. Uh, so Bing's like kind of like. Uh, doesn't stand up because she's on like the uh, windowsill, but she definitely gets like kind of ready to pounce and her tail like gets really stiff and she just looks right at B and she's like, B, 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 chase me! And she jumps. <laughs> oh, I'm out. I'm out the door. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're racing. <laughs> yeah. Wait, no, come back! And just like, I'm, I, I, and I'm, I follow. I follow. I, yeah. My wings a flutter. <laughs> All right, sparkles, I went off to the races. And I'm just off. Binks, what, <laughs> what direction do you head? I just follow them. Let's say oh. Binks, since uh, she appears to be in the lead. Mm. Uh-oh. That's a problem. Uh, what was the question? What what direction <laughs> do you head? Uh, well, uh, I go left, then right, then over to the side, and then up, and then over. <laughs> chase, chase. Big circle. Big circle. Big circle. Uh, and you guys are all I chasing her. I am not her. a leader. <laughs> oh no, I'm a ranger. I'm the leader. 
I've never played a I'm not a leader. Oh my right. god, I'm a leader. <laughs> oh, right. Well, then, um, as I am uh, jumping around and like, uh, you know, play tackling B and it's all legs and tails, um, at one point it stops and I'm on my back and I have like little binks, like I'm holding her like up because she's way smaller than me. And I'm like, wait a second, which way are we supposed to go? Uh, looks at my notes of like what I was, when I was talking to <laughs> Sir Talabar, I'm like, is there anything? Is there anything? Is there anything? Did, did we ask him where the Lilac Lagoon is? Uh, he mentioned well, it multiple times. We were okay. heading to North Boots. He said it was North. north. Yeah. There you go. He said yes. it was North. There you if, go. Do we, is there somebody here who knows where North is? Oh, uh, yes. I did the same thing. <laughs> did you? Oh, no, there. There goes the two. Uh, uh. We did the same uh, thing. I, <laughs> I think I, can we both like, like do that, lick our finger, hold it up, and then in unison, yes. Yeah, <laughs> the entire team. Um, but yeah, uh, because B and Binks both know where North is, we mm. we tackle, play, and chase northward. Okay. Beautiful. The only way I would know what was North is I would if the numbers on the streets are going up. If other than that, there's no way to know. Look, I know living in a city with a grid is really, really nice, but at some point, you have to gain some sense of direction. No, you don't. No, you don't. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> And just like trots alongside them, just, like <laughs> trying to keep up. I had a friend, um, uh, Ginny Penny Smith, and she was great. Uh, I called her GPS for short, and she always told me where to go. She had the best sense of direction. We all need a GPS in our lives from time to time, Mrs. Oh. Penny. Uh. Ginny Penny Smith, she's she's the greatest. Ginny Penny Smith. So uh, what does it look? What does the what does the landscape look like around here? Is it uh, is uh, is the is it swampy? Is it, are we getting is it less watery? mud, please? <laughs> uh, it's 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 a bit marshy. It used to be swampy. Uh, there's patches of dry ground periodically. Uh, it looks like there are uh, sprouts and trees starting to grow again. Uh, you occasionally see some wildlife, uh, some other bunny rabbits, perhaps. Uh, you see some other herringons. Uh, small little little packs of them, four and five, running around. Uh, some of them are playing, um, and and uh, you see cottages and what have you off to the sides here and there. Um, and it seems like a very peaceful place. Everyone seems like like the entire land has let out a sigh of relief that mm. maybe had been holding its breath for many many years, and is finally able to and exhale and and breathe and grow and and be itself again. I don't trust this for a minute. <laughs> I'm keeping an eye. I'm keeping an eye on the bunny rabbits, all of them. Just saying. Like, Keep going. All right. So specific. Uh, so yeah, so so as you uh, continue to head north, uh, Binks and B are kind of playing and uh, mm. Sparrow, uh, as you see, Bugsy and the other the other two are playing, playing and Bugsy's kind of looking around, uh, kind of mistrusting everything he is, his eyes see. Mm. What are you, are you just tailing behind? Are you talking with Sir Talavar, who's kind of trailing behind and kind of mumbling to himself and singing a little ditty and night? Oh, Sir Talavar came, he came with us. Oh, yes. Sir Talavar's yes. with us. Yes, yes. yes. Oh, I didn't realize that. I thought he just sent us on our way. He's with us. Oh, oh he's with, I am with you. As Talavar is singing in like this, I, what I imagine is like a beautiful, like cool dream, any possible dream. Uh, I am going to like just very surreptitiously break out a very small set of bagpipes, and then at like the moment of crescendo, start playing a lot. <laughs> <laughs> uh. what? What? Oh. <laughs> now I'm just picturing the Benny Hill theme and you know so Yakety Sax is kicking in. Um but uh uh yeah, so you guys head north, uh and as you as you travel and singing your music, uh a lot mm. of the other heron folk, uh heron gone folk, uh start kind of marching with you they don't know where you're going but they're enjoying the march and they start mm -hmm. kind of circling around all of you and 
singing along and making up the words and and kind of looking at Bugsy like like at least Bugsy you think they're giving you the eye you're not sure they are <laughs> I intimidate all of them oh give me give me an intimidation check Why are we adventurers when we could be a traveling band right exactly I, I want that. That was adventure. a thirteen. That's a thirteen <laughs> right. from, the, from a like tough looking monsters. fairy. What are you what are you doing? Do gigs. I'm scowling <laughs> yeah. at them. You're scowling. I'm scowling. So so I'm giving them the eye, like, you better stay in line. Uh so the other thing is gonna fall like behind this. and like, like with this. the bagpipes, like right of like is is just gonna like stop playing the bagpipes for a second and then gonna like sneak up. I'm going to try and sneak up behind Bugsy and blow the bagpipes right in his ears to get him to stop giving this big guy to the rabbits. Give me a stealth check. All right, we're great at those. We're so good at those. At disadvantage, that is a 14 and a 13 plus 2. So that's a 13 plus 2, 15. And Bugsy, what's your passive perception? My passive perception is a 13. Ah! <clears throat> so so just like, as as you're like, you and this one herring on have like locked eyes and are really like, like, what's your problem? What's your problem? What's your problem? Just. <laughs> and Bugsy, Bugsy, would have gotten very angry mm. if he didn't love bagpipes <laughs> which it just so happens bugsy loves bagpipes. Love it. beautiful 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 b so hears all this like, chaos and just gives all the little bunnies like little flower crowns to put on their heads while they're walking with everybody beautiful. you guys are causing a disruption we're on a mission don't you see the guy <laughs> he's here with us we almost forgot him <laughs> he's a knight <laughs> This guy's a knight. You guys gotta take this seriously. I am a fairy knight. You're a tavern. Knight well, of I'm the a... Royal Sealy Court. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. yes. Right. Of course. Of course. Apologies. I should conduct myself in a, in a far better manner. You're you're a knight, and I've been a day, and that's just very wrong of me. And just like, and, and does like a deep, like very like genuine bow, and just keeps walking forward. He he kind of just kind of floats back, very confused. It's like wait, Sir <laughs> Talavar, Sir Talavar. The question really is, how far do you think it is, in terms of the number of jokes before we get to the Lilac Lake? Well, Prismia is not like other places, and time and distance is sort of a perception. So it could be ages and numerous, numerous jokes if we want it to be. Oh, if we think really hard, we might get there faster. But I do love a good joke, all three. So uh, while all of you have been doing this with the bagpipes and everything, uh, almost like cartoonishly, you see in the distance the horizon and a tiny little banks like far away on the horizon line. She's like, found it. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Very Ranger. good. Ranger. <laughs> did it. I always wondered what Rangers were good for, but I guess this is it. <laughs> I love You're it. Taking the range part of Ranger very seriously. <laughs> Make jokes on the way. <laughs> Let's keep it going. All right. Okay. Well, she's home on the range. So, I mean. Ah, oh, oh, yes. Oh, she is. Yeah. I fly towards Binks. Thank you. On my yes. fairy wings. <laughs> Absolutely. Leaving a trail of rainbow sparkles behind. Tough rainbow sparkles for the others to follow. Yeah. And you kind of have to, like, brush them out of you. They kind of. Each, each they'll, sparkle they'll stick is to your like. Face like, like has kinda. like two little arms that pop out and they're like flexing along the way. <laughs> One final. Forget about it! <laughs> okay. All okay. Right, yes. We make so our. So, what do we. As we, as, we, as we catch up to. As we catch up to our. Our ranger leader. Uh, what do we see? 
so as you approach uh, and you, you get closer, you see uh, a vast lake lagoon in front of you, a very large, very large, uh, and what you smell is not lilac. Um, mm. You see many, many dead lilac bushes uh, mm. around the surrounding, uh, the edges of the lake. Um, it smells like like garbage and dead fish uh, and and bathroom. Uh, it, it just not a, not a happy place. Um, there are floating islands of just trash and debris uh, kind of going around. It looks like uh, cast off uh, armor and weapons, just rusty, just garbage uh, that were just cast off here by bandits and stuff over the many, many, many years. Um, uh, and as you approach, uh, you hear off to the side the voice of someone... Uh, kind of a high voice, uh, kind of stomping and growling and scratching mm. and very upset. And so Talavar's like, oh, that is butter boots. Let's go see. As the ground is shaking, it's like, that's butter boots? <laughs> Binks is like, I can't okay. believe it's butter boots. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Waiting for 15 minutes. <laughs> there must be so much butter. All I wanted. I'm done with screen. Thank you. I'm That's so proud of you. I'm so proud of you, Pam. <laughs> uh, so yeah. So as you as you head to the uh, uh, the the small cabin, uh, you see uh, what looks to be um, uh, a red cap, a small kind of gnomish kind of fairy mm. type, uh, kind of stopping and very angry and flustered and frustrating, and they're very red in the face, and they see you and say, Oh, Talavar, you're here. Glad you're here. Glad you're here. Who are your friends? Who are you indeed? Uh, y y y y hello. Uh, Sparrow. B. Banks. Bugsy. Bugsy gives him a look. <laughs> Bugsy doesn't trust this guy at all. This guy, I think, is trouble. And I'm going to give him a look. Gives you a look uh, right back. He feels that way about a lot of people. <laughs> uh, Binks goes over and offers a paw, and she's like, Binks, charmed. And very, very quietly, you hear somewhere in my vicinity, and we are legion. <laughs> Just like looks around, looks back at Binks, <laughs> horrified. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Butterboots uh, take, takes your hand very cautiously and pleasure, pleasure. Sean. Uh, but uh, B, B, what are you doing? Um, I am just kind of paying attention closely and kind of trying to like perception in the area and see what's going on. That's it. Just listen again. Sure, sure. Um, <laughs> but I like that. Don't trust anybody. Keep an eye out. I like it. As he says that, I go to cover Bugsy's eyes. I'm like, this is enough. <laughs> have to let it go, man. Small pair of bunny hands go over your eyes, Bugsy. Which are actually, they're huge. They're not that small. <laughs> oh, it's true. Yeah. You're a little also. That's right. That's right. Mm -hmm. uh, actually, yeah. They're Bugsy progressively smaller. Lucky. You have two rabbit holes. <laughs> <laughs> they are very soft and fuzzy. I will say that they are very soft and fuzzy. It is not bad. It's not bad. These uh, bunny beans are best in the business. <laughs> so, uh, so Butterboots uh, looks at the, the five of you and says, Oh, thank you. You're here. God, what voice was I using? I can't remember. <laughs> hey, like, oh. thank you on your hair. It's the Feywild. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but you're here, you're here. Uh, thank you. Uh, no, that was not. That was not <laughs> the accent. God, what was I doing? Um, it, was, it was something like, uh, like, glad you're here. Glad you're here. Who yes, are you? Yes, yeah, something you like here? that. Um, but my husband, my husband went out. He came out and went out and did not come back. Three days, three days, three days. Three days he's been gone, been gone and not come back. I'm worried. I'm worried sick. Uh, went uh, 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 okay. Right. Uh, which direction did did your husband go? He, he went into the lagoon. Into the lagoon. The lagoon. He took his fishing boat. We have a spare, but he took his fishing boat. He said he was going to catch the biggest fish, and he has not come back. It's been three days. Three days, I say. I think he's been gone three days. Well, three days, or is it nine days? I, uh, uh, three. Three. Thrice, I say. 
Well, yeah, but you said three, three times. So I just wanted to know if maybe it was nine total. Is your friend that mm-hmm. smart? Do they not do math? I don't think that uh, the the sciences were his strong scoot in uh, school. Yeah, yeah, no. yeah. Um, were there any like weird happenings that have been going on? Any other disappearances? Do you have any neighbors? Uh, no, it's just, I, it's just me on the lake. Just me, us and two, us and two. Me and my husband. We live here. We go fishing. He goes fishing and not come back. Right, right. Um, but they said a big fish. Was it like a really big fish? Have you seen this fish before? Is it a magical fish? What kind of fish are we talking about? I, I don't know. He said he said he catch it. He said he catch it. He said he saw it. I did not see it. He does the fishing. I would go, but my boots will sink. And you and you right. look down, and he's maybe. wearing large, <laughs> uh, large big clumper stomper boots with like metal uh, iron casings around them. Very heavy. Very solid boots mm. not butter can't, at all can't you just take the boots off but these are my feet I oh, can't take my feet your off feet? your boots are your feet yes aren't they yours looks down and is not wearing boots and just has hooves and it's like <laughs> touche you know, touche I suppose you're right I heard uh, any, uh... Sorry, B, you go. <laughs> no, you're good. I just said I heard mine are lucky, but that was it. You're good. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Uh, I, don't, I don't have boots. Uh, some of us wear shoes. Not me, though. Any, um... Anything been, like, stolen recently? Any, like, Fayex packages or anything like that? Well, since, since since the builder back in power, things getting nicer, things getting nicer. But as you right, see, garbage, absolutely. garbage everywhere, and it's stinky. But we try to make best of it and hope things get better. We've been here a long time. Family go back a mm. long time. But he not come back in three days. Did, did you see anybody shifty looking, walking around? I see someone Maybe in- somebody... Someone in blue jacket made of some kind of cloth? Something like that. Could be. Somebody like that you got to watch out for. Mm. Just little looks Bugsy up and down like, hey. <laughs> Those kinds of people are usually trouble. Mm. So if you see somebody like that, you let me know. I wouldn't trust anybody wearing blue. Leans over to B. I've been told I'm colorblind, though. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not exactly sure what blue is, but I know it's not trustworthy. She whispers just descriptions of Bugsy as this is happening. (laughs) None of it clues in, oh, they sound terrible. I'm kidding. You sound like an absolute Gibson girl, a Renaissance painting. (laughs) All right. So which way did you, which way did your husband go when he went out fishing? Well, did he go, did he take a boat? He took our other boat, yes, other boat, other boat. We have two, we have two. But he took other one, and he went north to where he likes to fish, on the other side of the lake. He says he catch big fish there. Okay. Would we it. be able, yeah. No, you're good. Okay, so you have another boat? No, I you, you have two boats? <laughs> yes, two, two boats. Two boats, three days, three days gone, but two boats. I'm just Plus checking, three. does... This real big fish have any kind of musical talent? No, I didn't think so. Okay, thank you. Good questions. All of them good questions. But if it's dead, it's grateful. Uh, uh, is this a type right, well, of, I don't know, hooty blowfish type thing that we're looking for? I don't know. But if there's more than one of them, I'm sure they might be giants. Oh. No, all of the giants uh. now belong in Constantinople. Um, ah, there we go. Let's just keep an eye out. If there's a flock of seagulls, there might be fish nearby. All right. Can we take your other boat? <laughs> you, you promise to bring it back? Promise, promise, promise. We Uh-oh. will do our best. That's it. I don't. Well, we'll find. We gotta. Well, you know, when we find your husband, we'll keep. We'll bring him back in the boat. Right. Absolutely. Mm-hmm. I can fix things. I think. 
I'm sure I can, can fix things. Right. Almost positive I can fix things. Best three out of four is a great promise. <laughs> exactly. And there's been a lot of two, threes, and fours been throwing around today. So <laughs> I think those odds are looking good. Oh, yeah. So It's only getting better. Yeah. Okay. You take boat. You bring your husband back. Bring him back. You promise. Wait, right. Cup, what? What's your husband's name? Loading. <laughs> oh, you need. His husband's name is bu- is also Butter. I just want to make yeah. sure we bring back the right one. I mean, if we go out there and there's a whole bunch of people, yeah, fishing, like, <laughs> bring back I'd hate to bring back the wrong one. If there's a lot. A lot of husbands out there. We want to make sure we're bringing back the right. Uh, certainly do. Uh, his name is Finch. Finch. Finch, like the bird. Finch. Like the bird. Finch. Oh, ah, ah, like me. Good name. Very good name. Finch. Okay. It's a good bird name. Bird okay. names. A great good name. solid bird. Yeah. I, I imagine that bird names are the. It's like you know. It's like ah, good Irish name. It's like ah, good bird name. <laughs> Oh. All right, Finch, husband. All right, I say we take the boat out. We see if we can find Finch. We see if we can find the other boat. See if there's any mysterious stirrings going on. Mm-hmm. And if we can't find anything, then we at least bring the boat back. Uh, do you have any other fishing rods? Um, there, there are two more. Two more in in the boat. Spare boat. Uh, Sir Talavar says he's going to stay behind with his friend while you guys go off into the lake to console his friend and to try to clean up the immediate area around the house. We need Captain Feywild in here. Only that wasn't just a cartoon. You guys have ever heard of Captain Feywild? Never heard of Captain Feywild. Captain Feywild. He's the hero. No, never mind. No. I did once, but <laughs> I blocked it out. That, that must have been before my time. Yeah. Uh, sure. Does anybody know how to uh, to sail a boat? Is it a sailboat? Is it a rowboat? Uh, is it a magical boat? Well, I can sail a rowboat and I can row a sailboat, but I can't do either one the other way. So hopefully that's, it's one of the two. That's a problem. Uh, I... I normally don't uh, do the whole boat thing. I just tend to fly a little bit. But um, I'll admit, I'm not the biggest fan of boats and water. Uh, ah, yeah, and I see. That. I hear you. But I, I feel a conundrum because I think, I think there's fish in here. Oh. <laughs> mm, this is I a think there's a big one. At least there was. With with your permission, um, Sparrow is just going to like gently lay a hand on your shoulders, like whatever is out there, it's going to be delicious. Okay, this. I'm assuming you're and talking it, to me. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. Uh, and is gonna is just gonna cast guidance on you. <laughs> be like, you got this. You can catch the biggest tuna in the world. Okie dokie, artichoke, cool. and I'm in the boat. <laughs> Alrighty. Hopping in the boat, going on the lagoon. <laughs> Gonna find her husband, or maybe something uh, else. So you guys all Is head up husband, into the sorry. boat? Yes. Yeah. yeah. All right. I'm gonna fly, I'm gonna be flying around above the boat. Mm. Sure, 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 sure. Uh, yeah, you climb in, it's a standard sized rowboat. Um, there is a bucket of what looks like bait. Uh, kind of flopping around inside a, a bucket full of water. Uh, it looks like mm-hmm. uh, to be uh, s- smallish fish, but they look like they're possibly made of gummy. <laughs> I love it. I love it very, Perfect. very much. Yeah. Uh, B, you notice that when you get close to the, the gummy fish, uh, the, the, the uh, saltwater taffy in your pockets begin kind of bouncing around in time with the, the gummy fish. Oh. And I'm like moving around weird, but I'm not saying anything to anybody. <laughs> I'm just doing this like weird dance on the boat. That's excellent. And just throw all these things out of my pocket. Um. So I'm sorry. What'd you do with them? Oh, I just threw them all out. Oh, uh, they start 
kind of popping around and bouncing around like popcorn, but then eventually uh, most of them fall out into the water and just kind of kind of pop around and kind of start skipping around little zips and zips of zips. I ate one of these earlier. And you Do got you temporary points out of it. Your tumble? Hmm? Do you have a rumble in your tumble? No, they're not dancing around in here, but oh my gosh, could you imagine if they just started moving inside of me? Oh no. I think we're okay, though. Uh, so, Bugsy is flying. Uh, <clears throat> Bee is probably too small. Sparrow in, or, and or Binks. Uh, who's going to be uh, rowing the rowboat? Not I'll it. row the boat, yeah. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> I'll row the boat. Um... Binks is on like kind of like the the front little panel, you know, very Titanic, you know, style. Only she's, you know, got got her face up and she's enjoying the sun and just like enjoying the rays and mm -hmm. enjoying the, the sea air. The All right, uh, you set forth on your boat into the uh, very putrid uh, lake and. Like I said, as you as you go forth, you see islands of just gross um, uh, bits and pieces here and there of uh, occasional corpse. Um, not a good time, uh, and it just doesn't smell good. Uh, you see dead uh, lilac bushes all over the place, uh, mm. but they're far from purple. They're brown and scummy and gross, uh, and it's just kind of sad. Um, but you continue rowing, uh, in a northerly direction, uh, away from the, the hut where you were before. Uh, and after maybe half an hour of rowing, um, you hear something zip and psh, something kind of snacks into the side of the boat. Uh, and you see like a, like a blue blur, psh, zip, psh. uh, Binks, give me a, uh, dexterity saving throw to not fall off the boat. That will... <laughs> It's dexterity. Yep. Come on. Uh, that's an eight. Okay. Uh, you have you... guidance. Oh, oh, what does guidance do? Uh, that it's like a D4? Plus a D4, I think. I believe yeah. it is plus a D4, yes. Well, uh, <laughs> you don't mind me, so... What did I say, an eight? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, 11. Okay. Slightly yeah. better. Yeah, you, uh, yeah, you're able to catch yourself. Uh, you kind of fall off to the side and, and your tail kind of touches the water and you jump. Um, Ew. But uh, at, uh, as you guys are rowing, uh, you hear very, very high-pitched voices uh, and blue blurs kind of zipping around and smacking the mm. side of the boat uh, as they go by. Uh, once they stop, you see uh, what are called uh, quicklings. They, they, they're kind of blue-bodied figures, uh, very... Uh, fairy and sprite like they kind of have a wavy not quite hair just kind of essence kind of going mm. across the top of their head um and they look like they're kind of wearing kind of bandit gear and they look very mischievous uh sparrow you're familiar with them uh having been in your, your realm before actually anybody who's been in the Feywild for any amount of time mm. knows them they're not so much dangerous as again trickstery kind of uh mm -hmm. if you will. i don't like them uh, no i don't like them not at all not at all you would not like them. i don't like them uh, I appreciate them. Maybe not being on the receiving end of them. <laughs> so, so. They're just trouble. They're punks. Uh, They're all so punks, crazy. I say. Uh, so yeah, so they, uh, all of a sudden, boom, you hear a thud, and uh, all of a sudden there's like a small hole kind of in the side of the boat and just a little bit of water starting to trickle in. Mm -hmm. And... Like... Uh, 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 I'm gonna... All I'm, right. From where I am up high, I'm going to yell at them and say, get away. Get away, you little. <laughs> uh, give me an intimidation check. There we go. Uh, there we go. This is a tough guy here. Okay. Uh, that is a 15. Oh, very nice. Very nice. So, uh, they... They kind of stop running, and you can see them now. They're 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 hanging out. There's like three on one side and three on another side. Uh, they're probably about maybe sixty ish feet off to either side. They're in they're on uh, the floating garbage aisles, and they start 
clocking and clocking and clocking and snickering and like, hey, give us your food. Give it, give it. To, we're hungry. Give us food. What do you got? What do you got? Grab a little worm, throw it in the air. <laughs> Just <laughs> like chuck a for worm it. at one of them. It yeah. So, uh, one of them zip, grabs it out the air and runs to the other mm. uh, end of the uh, the other garbage pile. Meanwhile, uh, Sparrow is it, like doing this whole thing where he's like trying to row the boat, but then also has one of their hooves like over the little hole in the boat. <laughs> it's like maybe there's another one over there, like puts the other leg over here. I'm going to try and cast mending while I'm doing this through my hooves. Oh, God. <laughs> it's like, guys, any day now. <laughs> uh, B and Binks, what are you guys doing? I'm going to be uh, standing and give a a stern finger wag towards these little critters and be like, now that's not very nice. You know that some of us don't like... <laughs> some of us don't like water. <laughs> that's very good. Very good. How big are they? Uh, they are, uh, I believe, uh, they are medium size. I believe. Oh, I was thinking much smaller. <laughs> I was I also. Was also I was like, I was like, my little mage hand will cup them, and I was like, Yeah, oh, exactly. Uh, I mean, your mage hand can they're still they're cup them. Just I think they're tiny. Oh no, they're they're tiny. <laughs> they're very, I'm sorry, they're very tiny. I was wrong. My bad. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I was like, those are some big ones. <laughs> no, they're 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 tiny. They're <clears throat> tiny. They're they're smaller <clears throat> than uh, big you guys. Pixie, very big. Yeah, pixie. what you guys eating? <laughs> they're smaller uh, than me. Yes, they are. They are. Uh, Have you been eating the toxic waste? What's going on? <laughs> Can no, I? they're 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 very tiny. Um, ninja pixies. Yes. Could yes. I try to cast a like a minor illusion of like a big feast away from the boat mm. and see if maybe they'll like uh, a, a large what? People. Sorry. Just a feast, like a bunch oh. of food and snacks and stuff. Uh, sure. Uh, let's see here. So illusion. So would they be like a like a wisdom saving throw? Uh, what is it? It well, it's a cantrip, right? For minor illusion. Yeah, I think. Uh, I think they would make a wisdom saving throw. Uh, do, 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 do. I'm going. I'm so sorry. Um, investigation, like you can do okay. an intelligence one, yeah. And or what? she could roll a deception check and oh. try to, like, she's trying to fool them, and mm -hmm. then they could, they would have to counter sure. that with sure. a. I'll give you a deception with advantage. <gasps> Okay, okay. Uh, that is an 18. Oh, oh yeah. Which is good, because my other one was a three. <laughs> uh, so all six of them see the feast, and they say, yay! They, and they kind of scream out, uh, and they all rush towards it, and as they get to where the feast is, they stop, and there's nothing there, and they all plush into the water. And Did I kill them? <laughs> Probably. No, they're they're <laughs> they seem to be okay. Uh, they are not happy. Uh, they start grumbling about smelling like wet dog, uh, uh -oh. and they start swimming off uh, towards the shore, away from uh, you. They're going off towards the east end of the uh, mm -hmm. of the lagoon, uh, and shaking their fist at you as they as they swim away. Okay, now we're gonna row really fast, and I'm like trying to do the row, but it's not going anywhere. <laughs> Sparrow, you have a helper, like, which is a—it's more of a hindrance, but hey. I love the idea that Sparrow is just rowing as fast as possible, and B is trying to help, but is just hanging off onto the thing. And I'm gonna help. I'm gonna fly down and get to the back of the boat, and I'm gonna just flap my wings really fast and push the boat. <laughs> Small folks just that doing uh, so Bugsy, much. give me a straight Definitely check. work. <laughs> it will definitely work, for sure. Ooh. I actually got a 14. Oh, yeah. Uh, you, you feel yourself pick up a little bit of speed from there Bugsy's impetus, brr, pushing it forward. Oh, and all yeah. those rainbow sparkles are just, like, flying off of my wings. Yes. Uh, so, yeah, so uh, the quicklings go off uh, away back to shore. 
uh, very grumbly and very unhappy. I'm sure there'll be no repercussions from that whatsoever. Um, <laughs> Definitely not. And, uh, yeah, you guys continue rowing. Uh, and after, before much longer, uh, you see another boat uh, off in the distance towards the uh, northern shore, uh, a bit off the shore, but uh, in that direction, uh, kind of floating there. Uh, Binks jumps up. Boat! Boat! Ranger! Boat! Boat! Uh, I will, f I'm going to fly, I'm going to fly up and see if I can look and see if there's, if there's anybody in the boat. Uh, yes, yeah, yeah, so you fly up. Uh, and you see uh, what looks like another uh, red cap. Uh, he is shirtless and wearing oh. uh, red pants and uh, boots, but not quite as, as big as butter boots. Uh, and looks like he has his famously red cap over his face. His body is very sunburned, uh, and he appears to be sleeping. Uh, has, he, has he been napping this whole time? Is that... Oi! Fetch! Oh, I respect that. <laughs> do we do we think this is do we think this is the guy? Do we think this is him? I, I mean, I could we, do we, should we keep looking, or do we think this is the guy? I feel like that is a safe assumption to make based on the small subset of data that we were provided. <laughs> okay, I'll go with that. Yes. Uh, yeah. So as you get close, <laughs> uh, and Sparrow yelling. Um, uh, Bugsy, you see Finch kind of the 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 the, the red cap yeah. wake up and kind of look up and pop his head up. Face is white and pasty and pale. Body right. red and sunburnt and crabby. Uh, <laughs> and he wakes up bright as a lobster. I'm trying to catch the fish. Yeah, oh, oh. days. Look, you've been I'll, gone I'll, for I'll... three days. I'll fly a little closer. I'll say, are you Finch? Yeah, who are you? I'm Bugsy. Oh, nice oh, to meet you. Do I not have I'm Finch. Finch. Nice to Finch. meet you. Finks leans in. Your wife sent us. And I, then you hear what? like a, a, a many voices. And she's not happy. Like just from around me. I, I have a husband. If you mean Butterboots. Oh, right. That one. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, is it been? Yeah. Wow. It doesn't feel like that long, but I got to catch it. I got to catch it. I saw the biggest, biggest fish you've ever seen. I saw it twice. I saw it once at home. And then once when I was, I, I may have been dreaming it nibbled on my fingers. I don't know. What does your fingers look like? I, uh, no, nope. I still got my wedding ring. It, it was a dream. I'm, oh, okay. Okay. Right. So, uh, how big was this fish? Uh, he holds his arms out, and he uh, um, he doesn't seem very sure of himself. Right, right. Finch, buddy, love the plan. Good plan. Big fish. You know, great expectations and everything. Very good. Finch is pissed. Butterboots is best. Uh, Butterboots butter is best. best. You're Finch. <laughs> You're Finch. <laughs> I am Finch. Butter butter butter. All turned I feel around now. today. <laughs> this is a really doing something. complicated adventure. Is the is the boat in the area? The other boat? Uh, he's in the other boat. You guys he's are in the, oh, he yeah, said yeah, it. Yeah, I'm yeah, sorry. I thought he was on the ground. Yeah. Okay. Misunderstand. I thought he was um, on the ground. I imagine at this point we've like pulled up alongside yeah. and are yeah. like mm -hmm. trying to. Get yeah, yeah, we are gray pouponing the situation. Yeah. <laughs> is there Reference. anything weird in the boat or the surrounding areas? Like, it looks a little odd. Uh, it looks very similar to your boat. There's another thing of gummy fish for bait. Uh, he's mm -hmm. got <clears throat> uh, one of his rods uh, hanging over the side with the, the lure in the water, uh, waiting for the catch. Um, and yeah, and, and as you're watching it, uh, all of you start to notice you're kind of getting vertigo. Uh, and as you notice, you're starting to all kind of spin around, and the water is slowly spinning in a circle. And before long, uh, the the fishing rod that Finch has begins to kind of shake, and he sees it, and he grabs it. It's like, oh, I told you guys, I told you, I'm going to get it. And it up goes over and pulls him down into the water. Oh, yeah. Oh, um, oh whoa, whoa, whoa. Immediately, um, 
gonna jump after. <laughs> uh, Binks looks over the side. Well, uh, Finch and Sparrow are dead, so should we just head back? <laughs> I greatly appreciate that my friends care yes. about me. I'm gonna try to grab Sparrow's <laughs> hooves as he goes over the edge. Uh, to hold him in, or... We all just make an assembly I'm, chain of where we're going to I'm a fairy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a fairy. Is like, I'm gonna... So Bugsy, Sparrow, and Finch are dead. <laughs> yeah, like, like she just then turns to Bean. It's like, well, they're all dead, so... <laughs> it's video game logic. Water equals death. Yes. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yes. Um, Bugsy, grab, give me uh, either athletics or strength to try to maintain a hold on Sparrow. I don't... Yeah. What is your strength, by the way? Uh, so I'm going to point out I'm a fairy. Yeah. 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 Say it. So my strength is an eight. Okay. Yeah. Good. Yeah. But Do you want one from a me very as well committed for... eight. So that's a four. Okay. I rolled a four on my um, strength. I will allow you the choice to let go of him or maintain your grip and get pulled into the water with him. Um, I'm going to let go, uh, so that I can fly up Thanks, guys. And, um, <laughs> and, and be productive. Okay. All right. Uh, so yeah, so Sparrow, you dive into the water, um, mm. and you are not, but maybe six feet, eight feet down when you hit what you feel is the bottom, but it's not the ground. Uh, it feels very large and very scaly and starts lifting up, carrying you with it. Uh, and the rest of you see uh, what appears to be a very large serpent encircling you, rising up from the waters, uh, and you see your friend Sparrow uh, riding its back. And you see this large head <laughs> well done. Of, of a serpent. <laughs> Aang is jealous. Um... Uh, yeah, and the serpent, <laughs> I think you dropped this, <laughs> and spits out the fishing line into uh, the the empty boat next to you. And you hear, as he as it speaks, the sound of butterboards, or I'm sorry, the sound of finch uh, within its gullet. Uh, excuse me, uh, Mr. Serpent. Yeah, thank you. The fishing rod's great. Can you spit up our... Ward. <laughs> our, our charge. Uh, Friend's husband. <laughs> I was... They're past their expiration date. You don't oh, want it. You really don't. They've like been out too long in the sun. Probably gone sour. Um. Uh, she she looks at you, the large serpent, and says, "Your friend." I, what did I? Oh, the the red cap was a friend of yeah. yours. Uh, a loose acquaintance, acquaintance. <laughs> but we'll be, yeah. <laughs> I think we're sharing brain cells today. <laughs> I think we are. <laughs> yeah, so. Binks takes a seat. Like, a friend is such a strong word, and I really don't feel like I'm quite there yet. A like um, friend twice removed. She, she kind of nods right, and she, she kind of winces and says, Oh, I'm so... I'm so terribly sorry. I was, I was just... It was hungry and it was not a lot of fresh food, food in here as there used to be. Is I there haven't... anything we can do about that, by the way. This place is a mess. It will take some time. But we will be able to get there. Uh, and the the end of her tail is kind of kind of coming around circle and like massaging her jaw a little bit. Ooh. Did, did you, I'm sorry, did you swallow, did, uh, now I'm doing someone else's accent. <laughs> hey, uh, did you, did you swallow the red cap? I, I think I did. He's somewhere oh, in oh. here. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna need to get him back. Cause he's got some place he's gotta be. 
and there's someone who's going to be really mad if he's not there. So what can we do? How can we make this work so that we get the red cap um, out of there before he turns into um, whatever it is that happens down there? Well, is this like an immediate thing, or is this like a three to five day thing, or can we get it out like rather quickly? Banks, you look like you had something. Um, well, I I was just going to say, just before you answer, you know, uh, like, just keep in mind, we don't really uh, have a whole lot to share or trade. Um, what about these worms? Oh, You're I've so had happy. worms. <laughs> worms are great. Yeah, you can definitely, you like these worms. Oh. <laughs> worms are tasty. I've had worms. Mm. Worms are great. But right now, there's something stuck in my mouth. If one of you would climb in there and take a look, I would be most obliged and will happily return your friend. Uh, I? I would like to insult. I was just about to say the exact like. Oh, no. Roll a quick little inside check on that there, sir. It's please. fair if we if we if we do that. Maybe. Yeah. Sure. Give me an inside check. All righty. My insight is poop. <laughs> and it's work. funny, I I am actually proficient in insight, and I didn't even think of doing that. I was just like, <laughs> all right. Uh, yeah, I have... sure. I, I will I will insight this as well. I got a nine. <laughs> a 16? Better. Fantastic. I am... me. Better. Oh, good. No, that's a, that's a solid five for me. <laughs> No, Bugsy one... doesn't need insight because Bugsy doesn't trust anybody. No, Bugsy doesn't right, trust yeah. him. Uh, trust her. Uh, but Binks, you are able to tell the, the creature is definitely in some sort of legitimate pain and discomfort mm. that you can tell. Mm. I'm go. I, I, yeah. Are we doing like a right. like a rock paper scissors? Who's going? I vote Bugsy. <laughs> oh, okay. Wait a second here. So here, no. Here's the thing, though. Here's the thing. Binks, if you think if you think that this uh, sea creature here is telling the truth, uh, and it looks like uh, lady that you've got something uh, that's hurting you in your mouth, uh, open your mouth up and I'll take uh, I'll fly. I can I'm small. I can fly in. Things go wrong. I can fly up. Vote full Maybe confidence should... on the serpent. We, we might want to choose the one who has some strength to move something. I know I'm being sizist right now. Like, come on, come on. Uh, I got, I got, I he he. So, Bugsy, Bugsy said takes out his thieves' tools. He's like, look, if there's something stuck in there, I'm gonna be able to get that out. Don't you worry. Spar- he, he, he takes his little pouch with like he has little picks and little chisels and little things. He's like, oh, I got, uh, I got stuff. So I love the, that you are narrating in your accent. So I am just thinking that Bugsy is just like, yeah, and then and now I'm gonna take out my thieves tools, and it's just like, okay, all right. No, no, no. Uh, I am uh, saying that Bugsy yeah. gets okay, really great. excited I'm about his Bugsy thieves is tools. Fully narrating what is going I'm to happen. On board. Oh, I mean, uh, that's right. I forgot, Bugsy, Serpent. We have a tooth fairy here. <laughs> oh, Bugsy will be able to take care of you. How fortunate! Oh, so much. Please climb inside. I and see I think what I you found my see. calling. Thank there you. Go. Go. Uh, I think so, I found my calling. Uh, the serpent circles around a few more times to kind of like curl itself up uh, into you and kind of rests its large head, uh, especially for you, um, uh, and opens its maw quite wide. Any or all of you could all fit in there at the same time if you wished. Okay, so. First thing I'm gonna do is uh, I'm gonna take a look inside, and uh, just to be safe, I'm gonna cast Fairy Fire inside its mouth to make everything light up. Okay. Just so, because it's the only spell I yeah. have. Yeah, <laughs> and, and Bing from down below, Bing's is like, look at that glowing smile. <laughs> <laughs> it's Crestland in there. <laughs> So now that now that it's got gleaming teeth and a gleaming smile, uh, uh, Bugsy's gonna um, 
uh, going to fly up and is going to take a look inside. What do I? What do I? What do I see inside there? What is the? Uh, um, give me a perception. Dish? Give me a perception. Okay. Ooh. Suboptimal. Uh, I I rolled a. I got a five. I got five. You see a lot yeah. of teeth. Doing great. A lot of teeth. You, you <laughs> probably need to get closer. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh. 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 Serpent uh, lady. Uh, what's your name? What should I call you? If we're gonna be getting this close, uh, maybe uh, we should be on first name basis. I'm are you Are you already in her mouth at this time? Or are you just on the outside? I'm just or? about. I'm about to go in, but I figure before I go into her mouth, I should know her name. Uh. uh they call me Ganda. It's been a long time since someone used my name. Oh, Gander. 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 It's a pleasure to meet you. Thank you uh, for your help, tiny one. I'm gonna. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna go in. Uh, I'm gonna turn back to the the rest of you. Anybody? Um, I, I am admittedly a tooth fairy at this point, but does anybody else have any um, uh, healing uh, skills of any kind that uh, we might need? That Sparrow. would be yours truly, yeah. All right. Uh, can I get up in there with you, or like? Yeah, can he? Can he? Can I? I can I? Can I, can I give him a? Can I give him a leg up? Crowded. Okay. If I like, I, I, I gotta like reach for Bugsy's hand and fit. <laughs> And like, grab hold of it, and then think better of it, and reach up with yeah. my other hand, and actually pull myself. Yeah, I was gonna say you would pull Bugsy down more than anything else. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, like, ah, yeah. oh, Bugsy, you're so strong. See, now they're being sizes. Mm. Yes. Now they're just being sizes. Yes. <laughs> uh, uh, okay. Yeah. All right, Gander. So open wide. This may feel a little uncomfortable. Yeah. I'm going in. All right. Um. All right, with the two of you, uh, both uh, you kind of wander in. Uh, give me uh, either perception or investigation, either one. I will give you perception. I will do another perception check now that I'm inside with my fairy fire lighting up her smile. Oh, uh, yeah, you have the fairy <laughs> fire. Uh, you take advantage with that. Oh, thank you. My God. Uh, advantage for both of us? There we go. Oh, oh, one of them. Good. I'm just going to be down there continuing I to butter boots her up and be like, they must call you Gander because you're quite a looker. I don't know why I'm a 1950s like. <laughs> but... uh, Binks just switches accents from time to time, and it's just. I think we're all. <laughs> this it. is the anti Matt Mercer show. Um, uh, I rolled yeah. in a like my, with advantage. I got an 11. Okay. Sparrow. With advantage, I got a 12. Okay. Yeah, we, we're right. brilliant. Uh, the two of us are a team. After a team, uh, I tell you. After looking around a bit, uh, you do see. Uh, embedded in the gum underneath one of the teeth, what looks to be like an old rusty sword, uh, embedded oh. into the gum uh, of one of their the the teeth. Oh, it's like <laughs> exactly, like yep. exactly like Brilliant. that. I got them. Uh, you know, it turns to Bugsy. It's like you know they say that the one who pulls the sword from the tooth gets a crown molded. Oh. That. Yeah, I'm gonna give. I'm I need gonna a give few you. I'm gonna give I you advantage on that. One. Out the wazoo. <laughs> <laughs> that was something. Uh, all right, so uh, so Ganda, Ganda, I think we found your problem here. I think we found yeah. your problem. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't say anything. Don't say anything. Okay. But, no, uh, it's so right. Let let. Uh, should we just try to? Uh, should we just try to give it a yank? <sighs> uh, I'm gonna take a look. Does it does it look like it's something we can just pull out, or does it look like it's hooked in like there or something? Is it like does it have barbs on it or something? How do you want to do this? <laughs> <laughs> That's a good question. There we go. Did you that kill worked. the tooth? Uh, <laughs> should we just should we just give it a yank? If you want to do brute force, you can do that. No, no, no. I'm gonna I'm gonna you know what? I, I'm the tooth fairy. I am the tooth All fairy, right. and I'm gonna do this All the right. tooth fairy way. I'm going to first see if I can finesse it out. I'm going to see if I can use a combination. I'm going to take my dagger. I'm going to get my thieves tools. I'm going to see if I can finesse it so that it comes out painlessly. All right. Uh, yeah, so what uh, thieves tools, what is it, a dexterity check with your proficiency bonus? I yes, it is. 
That's exactly what it is. Yeah. And I'm going to use a different D20. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Here we go. This is it. Oh, yeah. Uh, so that's a 13. Okay. Oh, my God. I've not rolled over a 10. <laughs> I have, uh, dead, yeah. so you, you get up in there and you loosen it a bit, but... Uh, <clears throat> um, just go. <laughs> Can um, I? Things goes to sleep really fast. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you do. You loosen the sword, but it seems pretty wedged in there more than your yeah. ability to get it out with. At least with that. All right. Um, I would like, if I may, to uh, summon my spiritual weapon, and I would like to summon it in the form of one of the giant like hook things that the dentists use to like pick your teeth clean and see if I can like it's like all right Bugsy you get on the very far end of it I'm gonna get here and we're just going to use it like a lever we're gonna cantilever this thing and it just watch out for flying swords and I would like to if I may <laughs> make a roll to pluck the sword clean uh sure give me uh strength athletics uh, the, oh, the, right. the serpent is not ah, strength, ah, strength and an athletics two rolls uh, no it, uh, it's athletics, athletics just, just athletics uses your strength you got it uh, with the leverage I'll give oh. you advantage also oh, I, thank you I need it because I, <laughs> my god man this our is rolls have absurd. been kind of rough tonight <laughs> this has been ridiculous nuts. no crits yet it's great no crits. No I've crits. I haven't rolled, rolled higher than a 10. seven yet. That's yeah. insane. This is a crit. That's All it. Right. You got it. Manifest it. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Yeah. Fairy magic. Well, it's a 12. <laughs> <laughs> that's a, for us, that's a crit. For that's us, with my light, modifier. A it's a, it is a 10. Yeah. Plus uh, two. <laughs> yeah, so you... you uh, yeah, like you, you do that, a and bit it, more it and doesn't like... want to come out, <sighs> and Gander uh, <sighs> kind of shakes and clenches as... Uh, ah, 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 yeah, ah, uh, and both of you give me hey, dexterity, dexterity saving throws. Oh, okay, oh, well, okay. Not the, uh, time oh, for a roll. Well, Bugsy, you're right. flying, so don't, don't worry about it. You're, you're, okay. you're floating. But Sparrow's standing on the tongue yeah. as the mouth shakes and jolts. What is happening? <laughs> I just and had to use the litter box really quick, and now people <laughs> no. are on the tongue. Like, what's happening? I. They're failing their rolls. That's that? a twelve. That's a twelve for my okay, that's, that's fine. You you maintain your footing uh, uh, within within the mouth, uh, and and Gander's like, oh, sorry, oh, we're doing. Are you just not strong enough? Oh, maybe. Maybe it, it it it's stuck. There's a sword stuck in the tooth. It's very hard to get out. Um, I would like to hop is... up in that mouth. Sure. Yes, yeah. absolutely. I think we could use a little help. Yeah, okay. just like right. a hand sticks out of the mouth, and it's like, and it's just like, grab on. <laughs> I I will climb up. Are you are you cutting things? Are you seeing here? It's well, a once in a lifetime opportunity to be inside a giant mouth. It's get. <laughs> Uh, Bink laughs as she starts crawling up. Bold assumptions on my life, darling. Uh, and, and I, uh, I, I join upon the tongue. What's the worst that could happen, right? Oh wait, total I party that. swallow. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> TPS. Oh goodness. I think if we all like chain on each other and then just like pull really and just hard. Pull really hard. Yeah. I think that's really good. Okay. And if not, I got something else maybe, but I think that my first plan is usually the best one. All right. <laughs> that sounds, you know what? I believe in that. That sounds incredible. Mm. Let's do it. Let's if do we, it. We just do what we've been doing, but do it harder. We'll do it. All right. The um, anime music comes on. <laughs> it's it's okay. all of that all I fails. Do is do it I, I have an idea, but we can try yours. Absolutely. Sounds good. Yes, no, right. big fan. Uh, of I, I, I worry, I worry a little bit about hurting poor Gander. 
So if well, there's something that we could do that won't involve something I, painful. Well, I mean, ideally, it's going to be much more of a relief situation. Yeah, yeah, it's true. Out just out a quick, two. just I a can, quick. I can say some words and then it will make things feel a little bit better. Oh, okay. You know? yeah, yeah, that sounds that sounds great, actually. Exactly. <laughs> you got, we got this. <sighs> We're not going to kill her. <laughs> That'd be crazy. No, 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 that would be. <laughs> we would be like signed up for so many on medical the kill lawsuits. Yay. <laughs> yeah, don't worry, Ganda. I'm like, don't worry. It's all good. It's all Go good. in for a routine tooth check, and it's like, I'm oh, sorry, you died. <laughs> <laughs> this is the Feywild. Uh, B, so what are you doing Never to know. assist or what have you? Um, I'm going to, like, position my body onto the sword, like, my little feet's on it mm. and my little head, and then just hope that everybody else could pull me. Like, yeah, with it, very okay. strong. Um, yeah, then I guess I'll give the roll to you. Uh, everybody's mm-hmm. tugging on you. You make the roll, mm-hmm. strength, athletics, uh, with advantage. Oh, thank God! I was like, I am not the strength <laughs> athletics person. Anything. Uh, you can do this. Do I have? There we go. This is a crit. I feel it. This is a nat twenty right here. Uh, do you still have any more guidance? Uh, I do. Yes, I do. Okay. But, uh, so. Bro, it's just it, good, it has good, happened. Good thought, though. It's okay. Um, so just totally straight correct. athletics, right? Uh, yeah, it'll include okay. uh, your strength check. Okay, because it's the plus the arrow, but I rolled an eighteen, so I think that's yeah. okay. Oh. There you go. Let's roll all night. Our only good roll. <laughs> I've yeah. never heard of a, num- a number that high. That's the <laughs> highest number I've ever heard of. They go uh, I got nervous when I saw the plus zero. I got early sweaty. Uh, <laughs> yeah. So, so just like Winnie the Pooh getting pulled out of the hole, you guys <laughs> pull the sword from the tooth and are now the king of Rustland. Uh, and yeah, and uh, Gander, the whole the whole mouth shakes a bit, uh, but the, the the rusty sword comes free. Um, there's a bit of blood leaking from the mouth. Ooh, immediate cure wounds. Oh, there we go. There immediate, we go. like, yeah, as soon as the sword is out, like, like we all fall backwards, and I spring up and immediately cure wounds. There you go. Uh, and with that, uh, Gander's mouth closes, and you hear a rumbling. Wait, what's still in here? And... <laughs> wait, okay, okay. You, you hear oh, a rumbling, and, and all of a sudden, the four of you, uh, plus Finch, get propelled out in a large wad of, of, of mucus and blood uh, out into the lagoon. Uh, oh. Uh, I, uh, I wish I had the mud back. Just uh, another oh. Wednesday. Vince's oh, uh, head right. just rises slowly and she's like, that is the last time I am helping anyone ever. Anybody got a press to digitate? Uh, and Finch is like, Bless oh, him, no. that was amazing. It was so dark and stinky down there. Yeah, yeah. You happy about that, big fish boy? Oh, and Gander's like, thank you. I feel so much better. Uh, it's been in there for maybe years. I don't know. But thank you. Yeah. Well, we're glad that we could help. And uh, I have to say, being a tooth fairy ain't so bad. Maybe a different profession. <laughs> uh, so Gander says, wait a moment. Let me give you something as a sign of my appreciation. And Ooh. kind of swirls around and the boats all... Uh, I assume you all climb back into the boats from the... Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh yeah. 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 And then we're uh, vomited into the boat. Uh, and she she circles around and goes down under the water, and there's very much uh, uh, waves and discrepancy and or not discrepancy. What do I think? Displacement. That's the word I'm thinking. Mm. Displacement. <laughs> um, uh, and then she comes back up, and on the tip of her nose, pushes a uh, large treasure chest into uh, Finch's boat. It says, this was down below. I don't know what's in it, but uh, it might be something good. Now we're talking. Oh, all right. 
Yeah, no, that's that's great. This so much makes up for the vomit. Oh. B, B leans over to Banks and's like, yeah, the treasure's great and all, but do you think she's seen the really big fish that's been around here? Uh, Banks also <laughs> leans in. I'm not sure, but I want to ask Ander if maybe they know my friend because they have some similar, you know, things. My friend Atosis, oh. Hal, totally, I just oh. think that they would really, you know, knock it off. You sure have a lot of friends. Wow. Very good. Very I good. don't. <laughs> <laughs> that was so sad. <laughs> uh, Y'all keep hitting me with the dark ones today. <laughs> <laughs> you have so a lot good. of friends. We're all that she needs. <laughs> you. <laughs> oh, very, very good. Oh, th Ganda, thank you very much. Thank you very much. We're glad that we were able to help. We're glad you gave back uh, Finch. And now, uh, if you'll excuse us, we're going to take this and we're going to go back uh, and give uh, give Finch back to his, uh, his hubby. And find somewhere with a shower, please, for the love of the gods. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna take a peek in the treasure chest as uh, as as we're heading back. I want to find yeah, out. I know why. I want to know what's inside. I uh, want to sure. Know. Yeah. Uh, it, it does appear to be locked. Uh, if you want to. <laughs> hey, what do you think I've been here for? All day I've been here waiting for this. And uh, what is that? That's a <laughs> look at that. That's a thirteen. That's an 18. There I rolled an 18. Hey. Nice. Uh, now what it matters. Treasure we're talking about. Yeah. So yeah, you you pop the lid open. Uh, it appears to be uh, many gems and jewels in there. Um, and there's one that you it it almost has a it's large and clear and seems to light from within inside itself. It's almost like a violet uh, indigo light that you're not sure what that could be. Hmm. Mm. Can I investigate that? Uh, sure, yeah. Let's see what skill what, it would be. What shape is it? Uh, it looks almost like a diamond shape. Okay. okay. Is yeah. it like at the top of the pile? Uh, it's uh, kind of mixed in with it. There's a lot of, and there's a lot of gold and whatnot. Um, yeah. You can, anyone can give me a... Uh, History check or uh, nature, perhaps. Hey, that's a fifteen on the die plus two is a seventeen. Sure. Hey, uh, you believe this is something you've heard about called an astral diamond? Oh, ooh, these are not very common anymore, and the amount of wealth that they can procure is uh, unfathomable. Can they do anything? Property why? Uh, they make you rich. Yeah. <laughs> uh, they don't perhaps have uh, any uh, intrinsic properties or, or powers, what have you, but they are known right. uh, to be in different uh, planes of reality. Uh, and depending on where you go or take them, they can be worth fortunes and fortunes and kingdoms worth of gold. Right. Pharaoh, are, are you like holding it right now? Yeah. Yeah, for okay. sure. I I reach out I to it. I will relay that information to the party. I I reach out to like touch it and mm -hmm. and I hit it. Uh, <laughs> probably into the water. <laughs> I will absolutely try and catch it. Dexterity saving throw. <laughs> All right. Let's see how well this goes. That is a 16 on the die plus two dex. Okay, <laughs> sure. So she bops it and you <laughs> and snatch it. Uh, and we don't end the Titanic with the, uh, the jewel floating to the end. <laughs> <laughs> I am going to like look at the, like the, the, the purplish glow you said. Yes. And just like after you've tried to knock it out of my hands, just, like, look at you and just, like, slowly, like, still gripping onto it tight, slowly, like, place it in the water. Ooh. I'm still, like, looking at things, <laughs> like... Man, I think you were onto something here. <laughs> at all, but the tail is... <laughs> yeah. Like... Just, like... 
puts it in water. It was like, I'm not, what are you trying to tell me to do? Does anything happen? No, 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 no. No. no, nothing happens. No, no, All right, nothing. He pulls it back out of the water. And like, no. does it doesn't doesn't the lilac the lilac lagoon doesn't it's go back to the lilac? No, 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 no. Oh. Nope, that will take though. many months of just hard work. Oh, Sorry. yeah. <laughs> Who needs that? You're like, you know what though? <laughs> I bet you, this could fund a pretty ecological project. Mm. Oh, maybe uh, or maybe bring that one up heck of a one heck of a party. Or oh, one heck of a pug. I'm just saying. It looks at the rest of the like the chest full of gold. Looks back and is like, or an ecological project. <laughs> <laughs> or both. We'll figure it there out. We go. And sure. There we go. Maybe a little maybe yeah. maybe we'll an eco party. Yeah, there you go. Oh, and then we could do like like I don't know, like nature themed Jello shots. Yeah. That sounds good. I was out, now I'm in. <laughs> <laughs> now we're talking. Yes. Uh, so yeah, so you guys head back south to to the other end of mm. the lake, I assume? Yes. To, yep. to uh, Finch and Butterboots' home. Uh, yeah. You get back, it takes maybe maybe an hour to, uh, to, to row back uh, across the way, uh, and you get there. And Finch is uh, very happy, but very tired. Uh, Butterboots is very relieved. Uh, they offer you their house's hospitality. Uh, they offer to cook you a wonderful meal in thanks. Um, and unfortunately, Finch did not catch any actual fish. Uh, so they have some rock grubs and some vegetables and whatnot to serve you if you wish. Uh, but yeah, but they are very thankful. And... Uh, Sir Talamar says uh, to Sparrow, you know, how we will report back to the Queen on the state of the lake and make it one of hey. our top projects to uh, restore. Uh, absolutely, yes. Yeah. Uh, um, things? All right. Oh, uh, God. Yeah, yeah, no, no. <laughs> I thought a joke, and now it's been it's brought up too much. <laughs> All right, uh, and I think that's where we're going to end it. So, Things was going to go up to Finch and be like, now remember, the moral of the story, don't go chasing waterfalls. Stick to the lily lagoons that you're used to. <laughs> oh. Have you so, seen Umbrella, way, uh, Umbrella Academy? The, yeah. The way that we're not a traveling band, but we're still a traveling band is kind yeah, of my absolutely. favorite thing. <laughs> We're just a traveling band reference. Yes. <laughs> we were like we in are the our room, own group. and then my brain just shut down, and it was just Depeche Mode, and that was it. And I was like, yep. yes. nothing mm -hmm. with this." God, when uh, when when Paul was talking about being a dentist, I had the uh, dentist song from Little Shop of Horrors in my head. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh God. Yeah. Yep. Uh, well, uh, I hope everybody had a good time. Uh, this was a shorter yeah. uh, scenario, but so much fun. Uh, I hope everybody had so fun. Funny. Thought it was pretty neat. Uh, a little, <laughs> something a little different. So yeah, definitely. Yeah, fun. yeah that I was that it. was a lot of fun, and the chat had fun. Thank was, for everybody who's watching. Cool. Thank you for yes. watching. Yeah, no, yes. thank you guys so much for joining us. Thank you all for tuning in. I hope everybody had a good time. Uh, once more, we'll go around the go around the clock, and uh, where can people find you? We'll start uh, with Patrick. Uh, yes. Hello, everybody. My name is Patrick Keefe. I am a voice actor and actor here on the interwebs. You can find me at that gray gentleman everywhere across the internet, primarily on TikTok and Instagram. I do a lot of sketch comedy revolving around TTRPGs and D&D &D as well. Um, and that is it for me. Woo! Uh, Vivka. Short, sweet, and simple. Hey, you can find me on TikTok. <laughs> Where it will be meta, and you can also watch yourself incredible and throwing your <laughs> talk to you in a minute. We're dealing, uh, -oh. uh yeah. Uh, I just wanted to say really fast, I never got a chance to uh to do it, but technically, I am a uh, what's it called, a swarm keeper uh, yeah. ranger. Ooh. Oh, so yeah. That, I was waiting, like, I was hoping that I was going to get in there, and then I was going to like be like. 
you can fit so much gingivitis in this and then slap it and then use like all of I'm I'm covered in fleas. All the that's all the fleas. Oh, the fleas. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, but that's... I will say chat caught on your fleas. Like, yes, oh they yeah. Did. Oh I know. Oh, yes, yeah. it was great. That I mean that was very specific. Oh, Eric knows my, my shenanigans. But yeah, yes. yeah, I wanted like all of the fleas to come out and use the uh five foot push of myself to pull that out, but you know. Whatever, fleas. I got fabies, okay? I got fabies. <laughs> um, fabies. Oh, that's great. Speaking of, oh, hi, great. I'm Vivid Vivka. <laughs> Speaking of fleas. Fabies, uh, flea ridden extraordinaire. Hello. Um, you can mostly find me on TikTok, uh, where my username is Vivid period Vivka. Uh, I am also on Twitter, which, same thing, Vivid Vivka. I'm on all kinds of sites. Special sites you don't even you don't even know, <laughs> but you could find out on my t on my Twitter. I'm there we go. It, there we go. Uh, oh, and uh, Lua, what you got? Uh, I'm Lua Stardust. I do all types of content from modeling to cosplay to D and D magic, just a little bit of everything. Uh, hard focus on TCGs and other cool stuff like that. Uh, if you want to find my stuff, you can go to lewisstardust.com or you can go to campcryptedpodcast.com where I release a spooky podcast every week. Woo. Ah, very Fantastic. good. Fantastic. Uh, and Paul, you work for some company, uh, Bartles and James, I think. Bartles and James, uh, uh, Grimlock and Beetle Beetlejuice. Uh, I'm <laughs> Paul uh, from Beetle and Grims, and uh, I just I can't thank all of you enough uh, for coming and playing. This was super fun. Uh, we had a great time, and I wanted. Uh, I know that you can't do, thank yourself, but I want to just thank. Jason for running this, uh, not only producing it, but uh, leading us through this ridiculous, uh, ridiculous adventure. You barely kept us in control, uh, <laughs> but it was a lot of fun. Um, and to everybody who's watching, uh, thank you so much. Uh, and yeah, we're Beetle and Grimm's. This is, this is what we're about. We're about having fun, bringing people together, uh, getting cool stuff uh, with cool people and playing with your friends. So thanks to everybody. Um, and uh, I'll pass it to you, Jason. Uh, yeah, everything Paul said, thank you all for coming out. We really, really appreciate it. Thanks to the fantastic cast for hanging out with us uh, and hope they had a good time. And yeah, and uh, Justice Armand is the, the writer of this adventure, uh, which you can find in the, uh, only through Beetle and Grimm's, The Wild Beyond the Witch Light. We have both platinum and silver editions. We are actually almost sold out of platinums. Uh, once those are gone, those are gone forever. Uh, we still have pre-orders available for the Spelljammer Confirmed! Uh, yeah. Platinum and Silver. Those will be coming out uh, later this year, late this year. Uh, very excited for that. Uh, and we still, we have over half sold out of our uh, Platinum Spelljammer boxes already, which is awesome. Those will sell out, so grab them while you still can. Uh, we have a whole host of uh, awesome stuff uh, for sale. Uh, I wanted to show off my shirt. Camera's a little slow, but I wanted to show that yes. off. Oh, that's great. Because I, I just went that. with the whole rainbow yeah. aesthetic thing uh going on um anyways I'm, I'm but yeah sorry. uh i run that unicorn dabbing yeah yeah <laughs> on, on a tyrannosaur that's a great shirt that's a yeah. that's a very very that good i love that yeah um but yeah no i uh i run the social medias for beetle and grims you'll inter if you interact with them on twitter that's this guy behind the camera um and yeah uh, producing these things and organizing this and just love being part of the community. Um, if I'm lucky, maybe play some magic with Lua in the near future. Who knows? Yeah. So, that'd be cool. <laughs> Falling down the rabbit hole again. Um, <laughs> and we have magic stuff too. We, we started dipping our toes and we did the uh, Kamigawa Neon Dynasty uh, Platinum and Silver Editions, which are shipping now and getting great reviews. Uh, people are loving those. Uh, yeah, we got a whole host of products. Yeah, um, and next week we're going to be announcing our next magic product. Oh, that's not exciting. I know what that is. And it's super cool. I'm super excited for it. Uh, yeah, it's going to, it's something. It's going to be something. I'm yeah, it's going right to uh, Yes, I won't. <laughs> I, am, I am interested uh, in this pertains to my interests. Yes, so uh, yeah, be it's sure going to be, yeah. So it's, it's going to be something. Yeah, yeah. so uh, get on our mailing list, follow us on the socials, get. Mailing list is the best way. They actually find out stuff before I do because I'm like, oh, we're doing that. Cool. Yeah, we don't tell Jason <laughs> anything. <laughs> but uh, but yeah, we're going to head out. Thank you once again for joining us. Hope everybody had a good time. Uh, thank you again to the crew. Uh, and have a wonderful evening.
Thank you, everybody. Bye. Enjoy. Bye.